It is unlike anything the Navy has in its fleet, but after years of controversy over cost and maintenance issues, LCS Freedom is about to deploy. Well, everything is different on this ship, which will leave Friday for its first deployment to the Asia Pacific region. New at 6, 10 News military reporter Bob Lawrence with why it's so different and why so much is riding on the outcome. That's what freedom and the LCS uh, brings to bear is what you put on board this ship. And that, in a nutshell, is LCS, the littoral combat ship. As the Navy looked to its future, it wanted something fast. Freedom will do upwards of 40 knots. It wanted something to work in the shallows. This one can be in as little as 13 feet of water, and it wanted a smaller crew to get it done. Because unlike other ships, no matter what your skill set, everyone pitches in. Very different. Janet Drozdak is a culinary specialist. We're all very close, and on a big ship, you don't have people coming into the galley and asking if they could help or any of that. And the reverse is true. If help is needed with flight deck operations or lines, everyone pitches in there, too. Freedom will carry one helicopter on its deployment, and pilots already love the size of the 7,300 square foot flight deck. It's a lot bigger flight deck, so um, a lot bigger area, a lot more area to, to get the wheels on the deck. Not only is the LCS different for the crew and the flight crew, but even the paint job is special. The camouflage is a subtle throwback to paint schemes of World War II, but there is nothing subtle about this deployment. But no doubt about it that this is an important deployment uh, for this ship and for the crew and for the health of this, uh, of this class of ship. Because from the start, the cost of the ship, the design flaws and worry over battle damage have plagued the entire program. But Freedom's commander said of the ship and crew. What we have done uh, in preparing for this deployment is that we are spot on and ready to go. Lines up will take place Friday. Bob Lawrence, 10 News. As Bob just mentioned, what makes this ship unique is that it can be reconfigured for different missions. Now take a look. The flight deck is actually one and a half times larger than any ship of its kind. Now inside in this next frame, you can see this is where the helicopter is stored. And right now this is actually how it's set up. This next image shows small boats and where those can be stored. Now the Navy is hoping to have 55 of these special purpose ships. Again, the deployment is set for Friday. 10 News will be there to cover it.